All right. Well, we could go check out Colin or Grit, but I think we're going to head over to Neotanks. Capture the enemy lab, move quickly before the foe destroys it. I I'm sorry, just angry Olaf noises fills my soul with glee. This is absolutely inexcusable. Uh, What's wrong this time? You know getting all worked up like that ain't good for the blood pressure, boss. Doesn't it make you furious? Look at what these black hole mercenaries are doing. They trespass on our land and have the goal to build anywhere they please. This land belongs to us, and most importantly, it belongs to our people. Every one of our citizens deserves a place to feel safe at home, and that is what Blue Moon stands for. And that is the reason why we can't allow such atrocities to continue. Okay. Well, there's no denying that the man's got a point. Commander Olaf, there's a base or something up ahead. It's just like the map said, which means that we found their hidden research laboratory. Yes! Soldiers, prepare to fight in the name of Blue Moon. Alright, for this mission we got a chance to play as uh, uh, any seal from Blue Moon as we wish. I think instead of our good uh, old duo right here, let's go give Colin a shot. Also, I just really want to listen to Colin's theme because it's so upbeat and cheerful. Don't judge me, you know you love that theme too. <laughs> I think I'll be helping myself to those new weapon plans. Intruders detected. Defensive systems backlash initiated. Ugh. I'm taking some serious damage. Computer, initiate document destruct sequence. The research lab will self-destruct in 15 days. So, got a question. Do you like Ska? Because Colin's theming this is very Ska. Alright, so this mission introduces those missile silos. We'll get into the nitty gritty of that right now, but as you can see right there, we've got two medium tanks and a rocket guarding the research facility. We got 15 days to get up to it, and also we got two enemy bases that they're going to start really pouring troops into to capture all those properties. Colin's units, I should probably go over a CO uh, card. Colin, an experienced little rich boy who somehow became a CEO in the Blue Moon. He views Olaf and Grip with awe and admiration. Colin's units have a 20% discount, however, they suffer a 10% decrease to their firepower. His likes are Olaf and Grit, and his dislikes are Black Hole. His seal power is Gold Rush. Boost deployment funds by 50% to all of Colin's units, gain plus 10 defense. Colin is one of the top tier COs in the series. Not because of Gold Rush, although it is a very useful CO power, it's more so for his super CO power, the power of money. Colin's units' base firepower increases to the proportion of funds available. They also gain plus 10 defense. I believe it was still the same as the original Advance Wars. For every 1,000 funds Colin has under er, in his pocket, his unit, all his units gain a 3% increase to their firepower, which doesn't seem like much. However, the fact that it stacks really does boost that uh, percentage increase, and you can do insane damage with Colin. Even units that have only like one HP to their name, they can, depending on how much funds you have to it, you can actually one-shot a unit that has 10 health with a unit that only has one HP. So for the time being, let's just start getting infantry out. We can pretty much uh, get infantry out at a very good discount, and Colin is all about pumping out troops, getting property, and making bank. Get you guys moving up here. I'm gonna have you go past these missile silos, and I actually want to see if I can get you into that airport up there. We'll get ourselves a tank to uh, hopefully slow down any troops that try to make a push for the airport themselves. And I probably should have built another infantry unit over here to help capture the properties. Oh well.
I honestly wonder if Fall Guys will ever do an Advanced Wars crossover and just make Black Hole Troops their, like, costumes for it. You can see it. I can see it. So let's make it happen, people. Alright. Launch the missile. Missile. And we shall target the units up here to soften them up for the main force. Missiles do 3% uh, damage to all units there, so I don't think these three are actually going to ever move from their position until my units get close. So we can wail on them quite a bit with missiles. Yeah, I'll get another infantry, why not? Unfortunately, um, I would have loved to have been able to drop a missile on their head while they're all grouped together like that. But maybe I might be able to do that. I'm gonna get you guys moving up here. Let's deny them a missile. Hmm. Yeah. At least it'll delay some property capture for a bit. Get you guys and soften you up a little bit more. Uh, I feel like the tank's gonna wipe out my troops, so I'm not even gonna try to push into there. I'll use the missiles over there to soften up those three up there. So for the time being, let's take this airport in the name of Blue Moon and start taking out the troops up here. so we can finish him off. Maybe I can get a battle copter over there to finish him off.
at least that bought us a little bit of time. Now they are basically completely useless. Now I just need to get my helicopters over there, wipe them out, and we are good to go. I'll probably try to get at least a tank out before I make the push to the lab. Oh, no, now they're starting to make a run to heal up. Smug look on her face every time she gets a critical victory. Uh oh, I think she might have come to my plan. So I need to give her an enticing target down here. I guess right here. I mainly want to just do some damage to that anterior unit. kind of curious because I wasn't really paying attention to the top corner. How close are we to our CO power at this point? Because I feel like we at least would have enough for our regular CO power by now. definitely pushing to take those cities up there. troops. Nope. 
I'm kind of surprised you're not moving those out of the way so that you can just send the anti-airs up there. Oh, because you're going to do that instead. Oh, there's no money at least. You know what? Money buys power. I need money. I need money right now. That was not enough money. Money might be able to buy power, but it definitely did not buy me a tank. Attacking me with non anti air units. I mean, yeah, true, you're whittling away my forces bit by bit, but at the same time, you would have already had them wiped out by now. So long as I can keep our forces over here, we should be good. wasting my time and that's the one thing I do not want. Days left. I gotta make I gotta make these days count. Operation Enticing Target. I 
I actually don't know if we're going to be able to capture it in time. Yeah, we got four days, but if they go after anything except... If they go after those infantry there, I'm going to be cutting it really close. Hoping to God that they do not attack that infantry. Okay, going for the APC, good. The infantry on the right is scaring me. Nah, damn it. Ugh. I was really hoping you guys would go for the... Oh, God, that did a lot of damage. Hmm. I don't even know how much of a choice I have to take out the infantry if I want to... capture that lab. damage at six, so I got two more turns before that thing gets destroyed. I think we could possibly pull this off. Cutting it really close, but I think it is doable. Mm, not in that case, though. I'm gonna move you back here to hide. Because the APC distraction. I really should have saved one of those missiles for like this moment right here. say that this mission's a failure. We only have how many days? It was like three days left to do this. It would take four at the minimum with those troops right there and they're gonna get gonna get taken care of. say maybe I could try to box them in and just use my vehicles as makeshift walls but unfortunately that will not give me enough to yeah if I had at least one more day I probably could have pulled it off
Especially when she pulls such BS like that. Doesn't even attack my troops either, just does that to annoy me. Yep, we've lost this. Alright. Let's just... Uh, let's just yield. Yes! God, oh, but for starters, we might make use of those missiles with ours, only ours, and lots of troops out of the way to right off the bat. Got any thoughts on the matter, son? I think send out an APC with troops to capture that base up over there. Yeah. Yeah. Focus on the missiles and the base, and then we can move in on the enemy. Yes. Damn, our first defeat. It only took us about four hours to get into it. All right. Well, well let's retry. Cut off the bridge. Take care of you guys so you don't harass my troops while they capture the lab. And why not? Let's just build some defenses back here. I'm probably never going to use them, but hey, you know... Troops are troops. Oh, she caught on to my plan. She is just beelining for that bridge. Oh, you thought you could get across this? You fool. She is so desperate to get across at this point. Alright, let's just finally be done with this. Give me those neo-tanks. That's right, Finders Keepers! We found the weapon plans, and now they're ours to keep! With these plans, I reckon we'll be able to use this new weapon in the next battle. Yes. Huh. These blueprints. Not bad. Alright, start building new weapons, and we'll be waiting at the next battlefield. Could have been a little bit better. I probably could have wiped out a good number of retreats.